I don't know if now is a silly snow because we will go to an elevation I think of 2,000 meters or something like that. After a nice time in Fez, our journey continues driving slowly south. Guys, Morocco at blue, no problem. I filled at blue diesel, everything here. So we have a full tank, full water, awesome. Shukran to all the people that we met here. I love it. Our next stop is Ifren, a beautiful Moroccan town located 1,700 meters high and just 70 kilometers or 40 miles from Fez. I am Isabella and I am from Brazil. This is Fabian, and he is German. We've been overlanding the world with our home sweet home, Frank the Tank, for the past almost four years. And together with our son Matteo and our two lovely dogs, Uni from Spain and Basco from Germany, we are living given for before. Subscribe and welcome to the family. Here we are in Ifran! We are going now for a little walk around to see the city because here the thing that is to do is to walk around and see the houses that look like Switzerland. Let's see how is that. There is an explanation for this European atmosphere. Ifran was built by the French in 1929 designed for colonial families to cool off during the hot summers far from the unbearable heat of the coast. Today, it remains an elegant holiday resort and popular tourist destination, which is much loved by both Europeans and local tourists. Ifren's places of interest are located in its downtown area, and the rest of the city is almost entirely residential. Although it doesn't have the characteristic maze-like layout of other cities in Morocco, you can see it's still worth it to take a walk through the streets, to appreciate the contrast and its peculiar house with peak-shaped roofs. We didn't visit the ski area, but Ifren also boasts a winter sports resort with five ski lopes and two ski lifts, all surrounded by the famous Great Cedar Forest. Up there, guys, a nest. I think this is the one that bring babies, right? I don't know, really big birds up there, so beautiful. Where looks like we are guys, now Mateo where do you think we are? Looks like we are in Europe, but we are not, we are in Morocco. Hi Mateo, we are in Morocco. <laughs> It's pretty cool, Ifran. It's like in winter they have snow here and because of that the house is ceiling shape 
is like in Europe, of course, for the snow to go down. And it's really nice to have a city like that. I would never expect a European city look like <laughs> in Morocco. But it's really nice. Amadeo, o que você acha? Uh-huh. Strolling around to see what else Ifran has to offer. We saw lots of houses in front here. We are going back now to the truck and I think we will sleep in Asro. And there supposedly is good hikes and also monkeys, macaques. And this will be amazing. Let's see then. Doing my research, I also found that, according to a data from NBC News in 2015, this little Switzerland is also considered one of the cleanest places in the world. Wow. In fact, in Ifran, there are no industries that can pollute the air or water supply. Together with the low population density and minimal traffic, as well as a natural reserve park, makes the perfect place to visit. This lion sculpture is one of Ifran's most photographed landmarks. It was carved during the Second World War by a German soldier. It's believed that the sculpture is in honor of the last remaining wild Atlas lion killed close to Ephraim. And we are parked on the other side. You see, guys, this white car on the corner. Down there is where we are parked. And here is the center. It's unbelievable. So close. Yeah, Matezin starts. Let's walk a little to sleep. By the way guys, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and to give us a thumbs up if you are enjoying this video. Thank you! Some people told us that uh, if France is a pretty safe, safe place to park for sleep and we were thinking about sleeping here but because we don't have a lot of time in Morocco we decided to move to Astro and yeah, then we will leave this beautiful spot. See you in the next. <laughs>